When you begin to edit type, whether it is in Photoshop, Illustrator, or InDesign, it is important to be familiar with some key terminology. A typeface is the design of a font. It is what it looks like. A font is a complete set in one size of all the letters of the alphabet, complete with associated ligatures, numerals, punctuation marks, and any other signs and symbols. A font is what Johann Gutenberg had to create every time he wanted to print something on his letterpress printing press. If he needed headline text, he would have to make a complete font of 24 point times New Roman. If he wanted body copy, he had to make an entire font of 12 point times New Roman, etc. A font family is a collection of fonts in all of the weights and styles it is available for use in a particular typeface. The character and paragraph panels can be used to manipulate what are considered typography settings in Photoshop. The type settings like typeface, size, and, space, and spacing can be changed via the options bar or the character panel. The option bar is usually more convenient, but the character, character panel is more comprehensive. As you can see from the screenshot, it is possible to change the typeface size, font, family, and the letting, tracking, and kerning. It would probably be helpful to know what letting, tracking, and kerning are if we're telling you they can be adjusted via the character panel in Photoshop. Letting is the spacing between lines of type. Default letting is 120% of the typeface height and is measured from baseline to baseline. Tracking is horizontal spacing between all the characters on a line or body of type. And kerning is the horizontal spacing between just two characters or a pair of characters. You can see these typography basic principles illustrated below.